30 minutes. 30 minutes, guys. I don't want to catch that. Ouch! That'll get that rascal stuck in me. A couple of 13 inch crappie. Um, guys, these are just nice crappie. Okay? If you want to see how I do it, you want to see how I do this, guys, just come and check out the video. This is, listen, I do a lot of things, baby, but changing ain't one of them. This is your boy Cam. Let's get to it. Yank! Guys, we're in October. Let me show you guys something. I'm going to give you some, some, some intel, and it's important. People think that the best part about watching crappie videos is not, it's not watching people catch crappie. That's not the best part of it. It is the intel that people give you. That is the best part of it, okay? So that way you guys can get off the sofa, get out in front of the computer, get out in front of your phone, and get out there and do it yourself. That's what this, that's what this whole thing is about, okay? So when you're watching somebody's video and, listen, you think that you're wanting to see them catch fish. That's not, that's not where it is. It's the intel that they give you in order for you to duplicate and get out there and do it yourself. Okay, let me show you something. You see it's shady. Okay, the sun's up right now. It is 922. I let you guys see it. 922. Okay. Sun's up, but it's shining over here on this side. Look at the houses. Look. Man, this weather's changing and it's messing with my allergies. You can see. Look at the sun. Bright, bright. Look at the trees. Look over this way. Look at the trees. Bright. Super bright, right? You see that? Let me give you a full panoramic view. Look at that. Trees bright. But look over here. You still got condensation on the water. Look. Look over here. It's shady. It's shady. You see that, that orange dock over there? You see that? Or oh, somebody, some of you guys may call it brown. You see that brown dock? I'm about, I'm about eight meters catching crappie right in front of that dock. Look at all. Look, look. Let me show it to you again. Look at all this water, right? Look at all this water. Look at all this water. And look where the crappie are. Look at that. They, they're not out in big water. They're not at, out in big water yet. This is probably the last video that I'm going to do spider rigging with my 10-footers. It's probably the last video because you can see I got my scully on and I got my hoodie on. Okay? 80% of the fish are in 20% of the water. Right over there, I'm going to creep up while we're talking right here, guys. I'm going to creep up while I get myself together. Um... Man, my eyes are, are, are running, um, my nose is running, my throat. I got one marker down and they're in about like a, 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 a 20 by 20 by 20 inch area. If you're not right there on that area, they're not biting. Okay, so I threw a marker down. You guys saw me on my last video. If you haven't seen my last video, go to my channel and you'll see me fish this spot to let you know that it's not on a whim. Okay, you can see it's shady. Out there it's sunny. Can you guys see that marker now? Listen, we decided before we even get set up, look at this. Look at this. I'm not even fully set up. Look at this. Yank! I'm not even fully set up yet. Guys, listen. Look, that's that orange. You remember I was telling you about that orange? I'm not even fully set up yet. I haven't even introduced to you guys what I'm running, and I'm already catching crappie. It's because the water temperature is getting cold. Let me show that to you. It's an 11, 11, 11 and a half inch crappie, and we're on a meat run today. We are on a meat run today. Let me explain this to you, too. Cam, well, come on, man. Cam, you're talking. Let's see you catch some more fish, dude. I'm on my way to 600 segments on my channel. You can easily watch me catch fish. You can easily watch me catch fish. I'm telling you guys, listen, if you have a favorite creator, let me get back out of the sun. Okay, you see how I'm in the sun like this? That's not where I want to be. Okay, I got about an hour to catch fish. One hour before that sun comes up and it's going to be everywhere. So let me get back in the shade. Remember I told you guys to shade the sun, right? I'm not even finished getting set up yet. I'm going to have a kit. You'll see it right up there in the corner. I'm going to have a kit with all the different colors in there. So you guys will be able to just, a couple of clicks, order, put in your cart, 
and check out. You don't have to worry about going and finding the packs, which pack you want. Listen, if you want the kit with all of them in there, I'm going to I'm going to offer a 60 box kit and I'm going to offer a 120 uh, box kit. 132nd, number 2 nasty bin hook. And listen, if you're if you're running plastics, these 130 seconds will work with plastics too, whether you're 1.5 or whether you're 2 inch plastic. It'll work. Okay, it's just something about that right now, that 130 second that they love. Now, you guys have seen me over the years run 116. That is the most popular size. That's in the middle. I'm trying to get all these metals on these poles. Technically, guys, you could just use two poles, but we're on a meat run. Guess what? More hooks you have, more fish you're going to catch. I don't care if you sit up there and argue with me if you want to. More hooks you have, more bait you have in the water, the more fish you're gonna catch. Let me make sure I got all of them together. I got so many dogs on poles. I'm running my 10 footers. I'm running all 10 footers. All 10 foot yank sticks. This is the hot pink. Look, I'm running the hot pink. I'm running the chartreuse. I'm running the um, white. Uh, I'm running what other color? I'm running the orange. And I also have a black. Look, I can't even get all these things all going to beat it up. Hey, look, organized noise. They're from the south, you know. In case you guys didn't pick up on that. If you're catching fish and you want them to go home with you, or you're preparing for a fish fry, guys, I have, I have the baddest. The baddest. And you're going to pay a little bit more. I have the baddest nine and ten footers on the market today i designed them i designed the paint scheme i picked out the guys i picked out the ea the eva foam i picked out the reel the reel was specially designed just for just with to go with that ten footer now my reel on my nine footer is, is specifically for the nine footer all you got to do listen right down there in the description right below this video i provide the hyperlinks for everything that you see let me get back on Okay, so I'm fishing in about 10 feet of water. 10 feet of water, and but they're suspended between six and seven and eight feet. Let me slow it down just a little bit. Now I remember my buddy, oh, by the way, I wanna say what's up to Tommy Lloyd, who came by to see me from, from uh, Charlotte, North Carolina. North Carolina's in the building. I appreciate you, man. Appreciate all the love. Let me slow this bad boy down. I'm going to go around and I'm going to come back to the marker is what I'm going to do. Because I think my marker may be off a little bit. Look at this. Look at this. Yank! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is what we're looking for. Listen, at 130 seconds, and try some minnows. If you're doing plastics, that's your thing. Hey, I don't have a problem with that. Matter of fact, I'm jealous because I wish I could run plastic. I'm a plastic manufacturer, but I have to give these crappie what they want, and right now they want minnows. Let me see if I can get this bad boy off here. I'm glad I'm kind of floating away from that mark. That'll give me a little bit of time. There we go. Look, that's the white. You guys see that? That's the white 132nd with a number two red, deadly blood red nasty bin hook. Let me show them to you. Perfect eating size crappie. Let me put him in the basket. Let me show you this to you. Look, I got my poles marked at six feet. Guys, it's just the detail stuff. The reason why I chase crappie is because they're specific. You have to, man, let me tell you something. You can pull up and you can entice them to start biting if they're not biting by pulling a few out, or you can shut them down. The key is chasing them. That's the juice. Because once you find them, you got them. 
And you guys have got to remember, I grew up bass fishing. Blech. Don't do that no more. If I catch two bass off this lake, I'm leaving. We're off on them a little bit. Let's see if I can locate them. The marker's off. One of my buddies fished this marker yesterday. Jeff, what's going on, man? He knows who he is. By the way, I'm down here in Atlanta, Georgia. In case you guys don't know where I'm located. More specific, this body of water, this is, a, this is the second largest private lake in the state of Georgia, and it's fed off of Stone Mountain Park. Some of you guys may know that, that, land, that landmark. There they are. Down there, 10 feet of water, uh, 9 feet. Wow, water temperature has dropped. When I was out here last time, it was 73 degrees, now we're 65. Look at that, there they are. They're packed up down. Actually, that marker, that marker is still on point. That marker is really on point. And change. Come here, let me show you. Let me show, I'm gonna show you guys. Let's see, let's see. Look. See them down there? See them? That red is the structure. You can see the, the blue with the number above them tells you how big the fish is and also it tells you the depth where they're located. See that? And that red hard line down there, that is the bottom. 10 feet water temperature, 65 degrees. Let me put you back up. That's what electronics does for you. That's what electronics does for you. It puts you right on him. He's a little bit too small. We're not going to keep him. Let's let him go. Again, off the orange. Too crappy. I'm going to go around a little bit. You don't necessarily, sometimes guys, they, they're floating around. Let's go around to the other side. Let's just float around a little bit. All of mine, I have mine right now. See what I was talking about floating away? See what I was talking about? See, look, look, look. Yank! Oh, what is this? Oh, man, look at this. Look at this, guys. 13 inch crappie. This is what I'm talking about. Look at that orange again. I'm telling you. Guys, listen, if I can do this, any of you guys can do this. Look at the size of this crappie. And also, he's starting to turn colors. He's starting to turn white now. This is a black crappie. I've never before caught a, a, white, a, a, a white crappie. This is a black crappie. You can tell by the specs. Nice crappie. I don't know what's going on with this orange. 132nd, number two. Guys, that orange is something serious. That orange is something serious. Listen, I didn't do anything. You guys sat right there and you heard me say, let me kind of go around a little bit because sometimes you have scragglers that are just floating around. Okay, look at that. That's what you're looking for. Look at the orange. Guys, this is one of my hottest selling colors. And again, you guys are sitting back there. Yeah, it sounds different seeing Cam talk about equipment because it's new to you guys it's new in the instance that everything that you see in this video belongs to cam listen nowhere else can you go when you place your order for your hooks that somebody custom makes them for you okay when the order comes in we custom paint these for you Tommy we custom paint these for you Jeffrey we custom paint these for you Bert listen me and one of my buddies we go toe-to-toe -to -toe all the time and I don't like cold weather, right? Let me get my, my needle nose. I don't like cold weather. I'm not a fan of cold weather at all. And he's like, and it's, it's real. He, he, he's shooting it to be real. He's like, Cam, I understand you don't like cold weather. I get that. But you got to bite when the, you got to move when the crappy moves. You got to bite, you got to get out there when the crappy are biting. And that's where I am. Even though it's cold. Let's 
to get them off of here. Okay, I'm going to do this, guys, with me standing up because this is very, very simple ABC one, two, three type stuff. Okay, uh, you guys see me out there yanking. Listen, don't, like, you heard me say this before. Don't necessarily listen to what I say. Just watch. You can turn the volume down and still watch, and you can get the gist of what I'm doing. Okay, let me cover the hooks first. If you decide that you want the hot pink nasty bin hook, if you decide that you want the orange, we sell them in 40 packs by themselves. Okay, if you want the pink, you want the orange, you want the chartreuse. You want the white? You can't decide which the, the, we, we these are separate. Right down there below in the hyperlink, in this in the description, you'll see each one of these products that I'm showing you. All you have to do is click, read about them in the comforts of your own home, and you decide what you want to do. Okay, so you can't decide on on which color. Look, you can get it in a kit. Okay, it comes with the 116 non-painted, you get the 132nd number 2 hook, orange, you get the white 132nd, you get the pink 132nd, you get the chartreuse 132nd, plus you get the non-painted 132nd. In case if you run into it, you need a 116, I throw all that into a kit. It comes in a nice water-resistant carrying case. I have them in a 60-pack, 120, and a 180. Okay, plus you get a sticker, plus you get a coupon, okay, on your next purchase, 10% off. All right, let's cover the rods. Okay, these are my 10 footers. Okay, you can see the 10 foot two piece carb pure carbon fiber. Okay, and they're made specifically for 130 seconds all the way up to a quarter ounce you can vertical jig with. Okay, brand new. They come like this. This is the 10 footer. I'm running the 10 footers, what you see right now on the video. Okay, these are my yank sticks. This is the 9 footer. Okay, it's white to red. The 10 footers, white to blue. EVA split grip. You can see I extended the EVA soft grip. Okay, so you can wrap your entire hand around in case you run into that three pound crappie. Guys, this right here will handle catfish, bass, everything if you're vertical jigging. A lot of times when you're out there, you don't want to catch those, but it's part of what you sign up for. Okay, the 10 footer comes with my cams reel, brand new. Okay, in the box. The 9 footer comes with the reel that matches the 9 foot rod. Okay, all of these are my products. Okay, it took us a year to develop these. All right, I'm a crappie fisherman. That's all I do is catch crappie. Guys, you have to add these 10 footers and 9 footers to your arsenal. They're made of pure carbon fiber. Look, we're the only people out there. Actually, I know of one other guy that does his in carbon fiber. And I want to say this about my rods. All of my rods across the board, because I got over 155, 160 rods on the market today. Okay, just sit down in Cam's crappy hole. You can just browse through at the comforts of your own home. If you break your rod, Man, I, I've only had one broken. That's because somebody ran over it with their vehicle. One of my 10-footers. Uh, uh, if you break it, your fault. You run over it. Truck runs over it. Grandkids roll it up in the window. Break the tip. No problem. You contact me. Let me know. And I'll replace it. For life. You do it again, I replace it. You do it again, I replace it. That's for life. That's for you supporting the small guy. You guys heard me say that on the video. Plus, it comes with a reel. Free shipping. Free shipping. You get two of these, free shipping, all right? So for those guys that are using plastics, I, one last thing I do want to show you. Look, 1,066-piece kit of tubes, 1.5. A lot of times, guys, if you downsize, you can just get away with just plastics. But my crappy won't minnows, okay? Look at all these colors in here. Every color that you can imagine, you get that, okay? Plus you get the hardware to go with it, those nasty bin hooks. Plus you get inserts that go in there. Okay, every color that you need is in there. Only here at Cam's Crappy Hole. Okay, let me button that. Plus, you get it. It comes in this nice, neat, water-resistant carrying case. Um, my reel, my rods come with reels. Okay, if you don't know which one you want, out of these colors that you see me using right now, you can get a kit. 60-piece kit, 120 kit, and a 180, depending on how much fishing that you do. Okay, it comes in this nice water resistant carrying case too plus you get a coupon on your next purchase for 10 percent off okay listen let's get back to fishing i wanted to show you guys this so you have it and i want to say this i'm on the side of the house because the wind right now we're in between seasons and it's very windy if i'm spider rigging that wind is my worst enemy okay so stay with me guys thanks so much for the love and support let's get back to, to fishing this is your boy cam yank guys that hook set right in the roof of the mouth Look at this, look at this, look at this, look at this. Yank! Oh man, oh man, we may have switched to a bigger hook. 
If we're catching them like this, I'm gonna have to go to that one-off. Look at that. Let's put him in the basket. Man, I'm missing some fish with those little hooks. And I'm running the number two hook, which is your standard size hook. <laughs> Get down in there. I'm gonna have to get a bigger basket too. I didn't anticipate catching this size. Look at this, man. I'm sitting on here fooling around. Look at this. Yay! I'm sitting on here fooling around and dude, he came back and got it. Look at this. I just happened to look over there. I just happened to look over. Look, I got a flying fish. Look, guys, a flying fish. Wait a minute. Let me show you how far I am away from the marker. Look. Let me show you how far I am away from the marker. Look at that. I'm all the way over here. I'm all the way over here. Again, this is one of the advantages. This is one of the advantages of running a lot of poles when you're spider rigging. Nice crappie. 11 and a half. That was the hot pink. Listen, you don't have to sit up there and listen to nothing I say. You don't have to listen to anything I say. Just watch. I already had my needle nose pliers out. Look at that. Perfect eating size crappie. He's been in the water probably three years, three and a half years, maybe four. Let's put him in the basket. Let me get back in the water. Um, listen, a lot of you guys have been watching me do this time and time and time again. Man, my scarlet chili. You can see, as I mentioned to you before, uh, I didn't even have time to shave, okay? I came out here because I knew the fish were biting. I saw my buddy the other day. He fished my spot. He came in here. Yank, yank, yank. He was doing his thing. And I said, let me go ahead and show some love. Let me chop it up with, with, my, with my crowd. Listen, do me a favor, guys. Please donate to my channel. We're trying to hit 30,000. Tell everybody out there about my channel because I'm trying to hit 30,000 subscribers. A lot of you cats are watching, but you're not subscribed. Come on, where's the love, man? Come on, show me some love. Listen, I'm going to get one or two more. We're going to get back in there. I'm going to get one or two more. And then we're going to wrap this bad boy up because you guys have seen me. You've seen everything right down there in the description. If you have any questions, you can just sit back in the comfort of your own home and watch everything. You can re read about it. You can do all your due diligence. And I want to say this to you, to you too. I want to say this. Every rod that you purchase, we're one of the largest manufacturers of ultralight rods on, in North America today. Every rod that you purchase, whether it's a 10 foot, 9 foot, 6 6, blacked out titanium, viper red, whether it's the thunder blue, whether it's the, whether it's the white ghost, they come with a lifetime accidental replacement. That means anytime this is your fault or not, we'll replace it. You got to pay for shipping, and I'm going to give you 80% off of a brand new reel. Come straight directly to you. If you roll it up in the window, your nephew, your grandson, no problem. Just call me. You don't have to send me no pictures. You ain't got to do none of that. Call me, Cam. I look up your, your order. Boom. We ship it out to you. And if you do it again, we replace it. You do it again, we replace it. You do it again, we replace it. That's the love that you get from a small guy, okay? That's the love that you get. Nobody who owns this many rods, this many plastics, gets out here weekly and shows you guys how his stuff works. The big box stores have been after me, guys, but you guys have been ride or die with me ever since day one. I'm not bypassing them and let them take my stuff, put it on the shelves, and I can't control it. I like riding with you, and that's where I choose to stay. Let's get back in there and get one more. Guys, you have to have these colors. Let me tell you why I chose to run this setup. If you notice, all of my colors are loud. Hot pink, white, chartreuse, orange. Uh, all the colors are, are loud. Remember, if crappy can't see it, they can't bite it. And I'm gonna tell you what happens. The color draws them in, and they come up and they inspect it with the minnow on there. Look, I hook it right through the lips. Let me see if I can show it to you guys. I hook it right through the lips. That's all I do, just like that. Hook it right through the lips. That's it. I don't do anything special. I can't sit up here and say I do it at this angle, this and that, that. Okay, now I'm in six feet of water. Right here. I don't want to be in six feet of water. So, we know where the target is. Right? We know where the target is. We know that automatically. But this way, look, look how the rods are all spread out. I cover every, this whole entire area. And why I use the 10 footers, I get, listen, let me use this as a metaphor. You remember when you were a little kid and you used to swim in the swimming pool and you would go down to the eight, nine feet and you would sit down on your, on your, on your butt, on your back and you look up and see the, everybody swimming by? Crappy can see this boat. They can see this boat. 
So that's why you have your 10 footers out there, way out there before you even arrive, your minnows out there. That's the same con concept, guys. Nine feet, 68 degrees. Look, look how close the sun is coming. See, it's almost at us. Once it gets this, once that sun hits this marker, ball game's over with. That's why we're gonna catch one more and we're gonna go ahead and dip. Maybe two. Look at that. Look at that. Yank! Come here. Come here. Oh, look at that. We missed that one. Oh, we got this one though. Oh man, that was a big one. Guys, we can't leave on that note. Oh man, I'm mad about that. I am mad about that. We cannot leave on that note, guys. We cannot leave on that note. And we're not going to leave on that note. We want that big one. Man, that was a nice one. Ah. Oh. Man, that was a nice one. Oh, man, we are we going to back out. Man, that was a nice one. Look at that. Now you can see the sun. Almost at the marker. You can see it. Sun's almost at the market. Once that happens, it's over. I think we may be able to get one more. Yay! Here we go. Here we go. Guys, listen. I want to thank you guys. Yay! Whoa, man, this is it. This is the one we wanted. I want to thank you guys so much for coming out here. That's the one we wanted. That's the one we were looking for. <laughs> Let me show it to you. I want to thank you guys so much for almost 10 years of love and support from you guys. Look, that one right there is on the hot pink. He's 11. We're going to put him in there too. We're going to put him in there too. Um, let me show you this other one. That's the one we were looking for. I can tell by, by the stress on my arm. Listen, when I say yank and my arm doesn't move, that pole doesn't move, that means you got your hub cap, southern hub cap. Let me show you this last week. You guys can get on with your day. Look, I caught him off of that orange again. Look at that. Caught him off the orange again. Look at that. Guys, that's a beautiful crop. Look at that. That's that orange. And listen, I, I don't I didn't anticipate catching this size crappie out here. And I'm running this number two hook. I got some buddies that use number six hook. I don't know how you how you guys do that. I don't even want to ask how many fish y'all lose, okay? But I know I lost a couple of them that were this size. This is your boy Cam, guys. Until next time, keep those hooks wet, keep those lines tight, and we'll see you on the next turn. Wow.